Now, apparently the big mixing desk here at Abbey Road in Studio One is one of the largest in the world, though I was told that some of the largest knobs don't actually do anything useful at all, which is what inspired the TV show Made in Chelsea. The 60s and early 70s in Abbey Road saw bands like the Beatles and Pink Floyd pioneering and embracing all kinds of technologies that are now considered a standard part of the recording process. These included tape loops, phasing, flanging, whinging, binging, backmasking, backbiting, overdubbing, overclubbing and overrubbing. There is a super secure vault here beneath Abbey Road Studios where the ingredients for a classic album are kept. And earlier today, one of the bands left the door open, so I sneaked a peek. I've got three of the ingredients here. First ingredient, track one on the album should be really, really good. Preferably amazing. Second ingredient, you also need about four other really, really good tracks. It used to be a lot more, but in the 90s it went down to four. Ingredient three, one of the tracks should have a rap by Will I Am. I'm almost certain it was Will. I had to run out of the vault because someone came in, but I'm pretty much certain it was Will I Am. Now, I've just found out that some of those facts may not have been entirely accurate, but here's one that is. What? Yes!